guys i'm Shar, and welcome to twist and shout well real quick i'm just gonna um show you what i used on my hair as well as my daughter's hair to completely reverse the damages done by heat and when i say heat i mean flat irons blow dryers that kind of heat and i would say for the record um mine was like just in my middle section it wasn't all over because my protective style choice was sew ins and weaves so i will leave my leave in out and this part right here would be all stringly like hanging over long it would not be tightly curled as it is now now mind you literally just um september october i was literally talking to someone and said hey i think I need to cut it off because nothing I've done previously worked at all. And it's amazing because me just doing my hair and fixing my hair the usual ways, I just realized with this hairstyle, I'm like, wow, I really did remove or eliminated all my heat damage, like in probably one setting. And what made it even more evident was um, I just did a treatment on my daughter's hair, deep conditioning, and her hair was so stubborn that it would poof like to a real soft poof. But this past wash day, she literally has an amazing curl pattern that's very similar to mine, which makes me think now that her hair type may not be different from mine. It just could have been so severely heat damaged that I had no idea. And with her, um, I was trying my best to, you know, satisfy her needs as far as what she thought was best to wear her hair like. She wanted her hair down like the other girls. And I, you know, for the most part, I kept saying, hey, your hair isn't for that. And I would have to put heat on it. But, you know, children don't understand. And I would definitely blow dry her hair almost every wash day. I would not let her air dry like I would do myself. And like I said, I'm pretty sure over time that caused damage. But this past wash day, I successfully, like, I'm talking about within one treatment and washed it out. I'm like, wow, you actually have curls. So I'm almost confident that by next wash day, her hair or her curl pattern, rather, would be almost equivalent to mine. If not even better, because she has complete virgin hair, meaning no perm has ever touched her hair at all. So I am excited. But anywho, just going to go ahead and throw it out there, what I use. Not going to take up too much of your time. Now, I have two treatments, and I'm going to show you the two that I used, and then obviously one of the two is the only one that I use on my daughter. But first things first, um, I use this Hollywood Beauty Olive Cholesterol, and this is um, Super Shiny Moisturized Deep Conditioning Cream for Damaged Hair. And by all means, my hair was damaged, and you get a lot for a little. This thing right here costs like three and some change. Um, beauty store probably be a little more higher, but that goes without saying. But like Walmart, um, Roses, the dollar stores, these are probably gonna be like three and some change, three fifty, and you get a whole lot for your money, and nice scent. Like this, this one smells amazing. This is the um, olive oil. They have a carrot one, and they have a coconut oil one. This, um, I picked this one up because I already had a bunch of products that had a lot of coconut in it, and not much that had olive as the dominant so i just said let me go ahead with this one but when this one is used i will go in and get the carrot one because my hair loves carrot too okay so what i use on my daughter this past time and what i also treat on my hair a couple times was the um african best the originals hair mayonnaise and this is a protein treatment and again it says treatment for weak damaged hair with natural herbs olive oil and egg protein so this is what people use when they, or what they say, or they mean by protein treatments. Like this is one, um, Prima Nature has one, Palmer's has one. Like a lot of these brands have one and you just, you know, pick which one of the one you think is best. A lot of people get the hair mayonnaise because it's the equivalent to like the egg protein. And that's the one that seems to be um, best for hair. Um, I know if you've seen DIYs where people actually crack an egg and put it in their DIY treatment. And it causes the hair to be treated very nicely and curl pattern comes out amazing. So I did this a couple times. And like I said, I'm just realizing with me wearing my hair like this today, like, wow, 
my curls and my heat damaged hair has actually revived itself. That is amazing to me because I was struggling with that section for years. I want to say like two years. So if you need something to treat your damaged hair, if you see you washing your hair and some patch, uh, pieces are stringy and some are kind of straight and others are suffering with like a curl pattern, looser curl pattern where you know it's supposed to be tightly curled and coiled like this, please, by all means, local Walmart, Loki, local beauty store or dollar store, get this. This is about five and some chains. It's a little more expensive, but again, it's a protein treatment. So that's still very great in comparison to other brands. So that's it, you guys. Just want to share that with you guys. A little update about the heat damaged hair. Because like I said, I was going to chop. And then I realized, like, you know what? Wait, my hair actually repaired itself with the help of these treatments. So try it, heat damage, damage hair, brittle hair. Uh, if you know you haven't had a protein treatment in a long time, try it. Doesn't hurt. It's not harsh. Um, but again, you know you don't want to keep doing these weekly. You want to do a moisturizing hair mask or treatment weekly, but not a protein. Like protein, um, you want to do either. I think the most I would recommend is twice a month. And what I would say or what I try to do is once a month. So, but thank you for tuning in, you guys. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. God bless. Bye-bye.